Hello everyone. Today we're going to cover a little bit of RF mathematics, specifically the rule of tens and threes. If you've played around in the wireless networking field long enough, you've probably had to purchase an antenna to plug into an access point. And if you look at the specs on the antenna, you'll see something like 6 dBi, 7 dBi, 9 dB gain. And we all generally know the higher the number, the more powerful the signal I'm going to see on my clients. But why is that? And how do I calculate what the actual final equivalent transmit power is going to be? The answer is to use the rule of tens and threes. And the rule of tens and threes is quite simple. It just says for every gain of 3 dB, you take your transmit power and you multiply it by 2. It doubles. And for every gain of 10 dB, you multiply your transmit power by 10. And conversely, for every loss of 3 dB, you divide your transmit power by 2, or it gets cut in half. And for every loss of 10 dB, you divide your transmit power by 10. So let's look at some examples. We'll start with the rule of threes. If I have an access point and it's capable of transmitting at 100 milliwatts, and I add an antenna that is supposed to give me a gain of 3 dB, I know that the rule says for every 3 dB of gain, my transmit power doubles. So I would have 100 times 2 equals 200 milliwatts. Moving on to the rule of tens, we'll do the same math. So if I have an access point that can do 100 milliwatts, and I add an antenna to it that is supposed to give me 10 dB of gain, I know the rule says for every 10 dB of gain, I multiply by 10. I would take my 100 times 10 equals 1,000 milliwatts, or another way is just to say 1 watt. The nice thing about the rule of tens and threes is that they're cumulative, meaning I can add tens and threes together to equal different numbers. So in this case, I'll take my 100 milliwatt access point, but let's just say I had a 7 dB gain. Well that's not a 3 or a 10 so how do I figure that out? Another way of saying 7 is just 10 minus 3. So if I do the math I would say 100 increase it by 10 which is to say I multiply by 10 and then I'm gonna drop 3 which means I divide by 2 according to the rule of 10s and 3s which will give me 1000 divided by 2 equals 500 milliwatts. So that's the rule of tens and threes. Just to recap, for every gain of 3 dB, the transmit power roughly doubles, and for every loss of 3 dB, the transmit power is roughly cut in half. For every gain of 10 dB, it is multiplied by 10, and for every loss of 10 dB, it's roughly divided by 10. That's it. Thanks for watching and I hope you found this video helpful.